Welcome to the watch list and layouts tutorial within the Infront Professional Terminal. In this tutorial, we will go through how to work with watch lists efficiently, as well as how to customize column layouts for a window. Opening a watch list can be done in three different ways. You can go to the main menu and then select Tools. Under the Utilities tab, select Watch List. Please note that there is a shortcut written on the side of this tab. To use this shortcut, press and hold Ctrl, Shift and C. Lastly, the third way is to type in Watch List in the Find Anything search field. Once you press and enter on either of these three options, a watch list window will automatically open ready for you to customize and use. To add instruments into your watch list, you can either type the name of the instrument in the watch list, in the blank field you see under Chains and List. Or, you can click on the plus sign that says Add, and then type in the instrument you want to add. Or, you can drag and drop. To do this, open up a market window by clicking on the main menu and then choose market. Find the market you want to open. Then mark the instrument or instruments you would like in the watch list and then simply drag and drop. You can do this from as many different market windows as you choose. To delete instruments, simply right click on the chosen instrument, click edit and select delete from the list. You can also mark the instrument you want to remove and then use the delete button on your keyboard. Save the list by clicking on the save list button in the bar and then give the list a name. The lists are saved in a cloud, so they are available on your computer, phone or iPad. The name of the window has now changed. The save list button has changed to the name you've chosen and you will be able to find the list under select list drop down. Here, you can easily switch between various lists that you have personalized and created. To group a list, click on the symbol named group by on the upper right of the watch list window. Choose to group your list by any of the pre-populated options provided. If you want to remove the grouping, click on None. You can also group the instruments manually by adding your own headline. To do so, right click on Instrument, then Edit and add Headline. Type in what you would like to call this headline. You can easily move any instrument or headline up or down by clicking and holding down Control on your keyboard. You can also right click on the headline and then click on edit, move up and down. You can delete headlines by highlighting and pressing delete on the keyboard. It is possible to convert all the instruments into your currency of choice. To do this, simply click on the drop down menu and choose convert currency where there are various options available. And to revert the instruments back to their original currency, simply click on none. The currency rates applied are from WFX World Forex. By default, the lower left box in the watch list shows all news found on the instruments you have in your list. If you right click in the news window, you can add or remove news sources that you have available to you within the terminal. In the bottom right corner, you will see all the events for the instruments you have in your watch list. In the same way that you did with the news box, you can right click on it to customize the time frame and to select what kind of calendar events you would like to show. This will give you an overview of the financial statements and corporate events from the companies that you are following. If you want to remove the boxes, you can click on view and choose what you would like to see. You can also add another chart which will show the winners and losers of the instruments in your list. If you click on actions at the top of the window, it is also possible to add alerts for the entire watch list to keep you up to date as to how your list is moving. You will be alerted if the percentage change is above or below a value that you set. You can also set alerts for a single instrument. If you right click on that instrument, then click on Create Alert and then choose the criteria that you prefer. 
If you want to edit the alerts you have created, you can do so by clicking on the clock symbol in the top right corner and go to Manage My Alerts. Here, you can edit or delete all alerts. A portfolio tracker is also available within the Infront Professional Terminal. Whilst within your watch list, go to Action, then Convert to Portfolio, and this will convert your list into a portfolio where you can insert volume, average buy price, and more for the instruments that you have on your list. You can change the name of your portfolio, currency, you can add a benchmark, and many other options. If you would like to know more about portfolio tracking, be sure to watch the portfolio tracking tutorial. To change the layout from default, which has been designed for equity instruments in mind, to another pre-designed layout, click on the content menu on the upper left of the watch list, then select factory layout. Click on the option you would like and the layout in my watch list automatically changes. To revert to the default layout, right click on the content bar in the watch list. You can also create your own column layout by adding or deleting columns yourself. Click on the content menu again and then click on select columns. Here, you can choose the columns you want to see by either dragging them over to the visible columns box, double click on the column or use the arrows in the middle. After you have added the columns you want, this new column layout can be saved for later use. Once again, click on the content menu, choose save layout and filter as, then add a name for that layout. Should you want this to be the default layout for all new watch list windows, right click on the content bar and choose save as default layout and all future watch list windows will automatically be set to this layout. All custom layouts that you have saved in the terminal will also be available directly from a market window. Click on the content menu in the market window, click on select filter and layout, and then choose the layout you just created for your watch list. Should you need any further help, please contact support at infrontfinance.com. Thank you.